Today we're going to take another look at the zero chart of accounts. I always say it's your chart of accounts. If there's anything that you don't like about it, then why don't we change it? If there's an account that you don't need, we can delete it. So let's look at how to do that. Okay, from our dashboard to access the chart of accounts, we go to settings and then we choose chart of accounts. And when our internet connection is slow, we wait patiently. Now let's assume that we have an account code called rent that I know we have, and we don't actually need that code. So we're going to delete it. We tick the box to the left of it, and then we choose the option to delete. It gives you a message telling you that deleting is permanent. Make sure that you do want to delete, and then you say OK. Now, as well as delete, there is another option that's called archive. So this time, for example, if we had a code that we've actually used, so we've used the code survey costs, but we don't want it anymore. If we selected that and we chose delete, it wouldn't let you. It gives you a message that says this account cannot be deleted. So instead it will be archived. Or alternatively, if you knew that you can't delete it, but you want to archive it, you can choose it again and you can select archive and OK. Now the difference between the two is delete is permanent whereas if you archive an account you can go back and retrieve it at a later date. And we have a slow internet but there we have it done. If we select the archive tab we will actually see that account code that we have removed survey. And again, we could select it and we could restore it if we archived it by mistake or if we archived it, but then find at a later date that we actually wanted it. Tidy up your chart of accounts. If there are codes there that you don't need, I suggest that when you've got a bit of spare time that you go ahead and delete them. It just means that when you're choosing account code from your drop down menu, you've got far less to choose from, which means quicker data entry, which means happy zeroing. Let's go do it. Mm -hmm.